Mr. Speaker, yesterday, Canada's former law clerk to the House of Commons said that the $90,000 check, quote, prima facie violates the Parliament of Canada Act and the Criminal Code of Canada, unquote. Will the Minister of Justice stand up today and answer a question, or will he let the Minister of Foreign Affairs stand up like he did yesterday to reject the relevance of our criminal law? Will the Minister at least recognize that this financial transaction may have constituted a crime and commit to call in the RCMP? Mr. Speaker, the government obviously doesn't direct uh, doesn't direct uh, the police authorities. Uh, what, we have, uh, what we have said is that this Parliament has established an independent uh, ethics officer, Mary Dawson. Uh, this matter has been referred uh, to her. Uh, obviously, uh, we have said that, uh, as we always do, uh, that we'll fully cooperate uh, with, uh, with, her, uh, with her any review she should uh, choose to conduct. The Honourable Member for Toronto, Danforth. Mr. Speaker, tell that to Helena Gerges. Mr. Speaker, at the very least, it's clear a crime may have been committed, so why the silence from the Minister of Justice? No one's buying the Conservatives' hear no evil approach to this issue. Now, the Parliament of Canada Act in Section 16 states, quote, no member of the Senate shall receive any compensation in relation to a matter before a committee, unquote. Yet, according to reports, this is exactly what Mike Duffy and Nigel Wright did. Why won't the Minister of Justice concede that a crime may have been committed and call in the RCMP. Yeah. Mr. Speaker, my friend opposite uh, talked about a previous case. I think uh, the independent ethics watchdog did uh, look into that and uh, rendered a rather strong uh, verdict uh, with respect to, to that file. Listen, we have confidence that uh, the process uh, in place, uh, this matter has been referred to this uh, independent uh, watchdog of parliament uh, that operates completely independent uh, from government. Uh, she will conduct uh, those. Uh, she will conduct uh, her review properly. She always does, uh, and will report back to us in very short order.